About 250 airline passengers flying from New York to Rome were allegedly left without a cockpit crew awake. Investigators say both pilots fell asleep while the plane was at cruising altitude, causing alarm from air traffic control. Here's ABC's Faith Abube with more details. Panic on the ground as two pilots were reportedly sleeping in the cockpit of a loaded Airbus 330 while it was 38,000 feet in the air over France. The ITA Airways flight, previously known as Alitalia, was on the way to Rome from JFK Airport on April 30th with about 250 passengers on board. One pilot was on his designated sleeping break. The captain was supposed to be at the controls but also reportedly fell asleep. Officials say both pilots were unresponsive for about 10 minutes, while air traffic controllers and the airline tried multiple times to contact them. Fearing the worst, French authorities say they were preparing to scramble fighter jets to intercept the massive aircraft when the pilots finally woke up and resumed radio communication. An airliner at altitude is going to stay at altitude because it's under autopilot control. That's not the worry. The worry is how long are you going to be boring a hole through the sky that, uh, that is unresponsive to air traffic control. ITA Airways says the captain claimed the radio stopped working in the cockpit, but an internal investigation reportedly revealed no issues. The airline says the captain has now been fired for his behavior and the strong inconsistencies in his account of what happened during the flight. The plane, however, did land safely in Rome. And in a statement, ITA suggests the passengers were never in danger, saying, quote, the safety of the flight has always been guaranteed in accordance with the highest safety standards provided for by aviation regulations. In Washington, Faith Abube, ABC News.